Hello and welcome back! I'm getting uh, quite cocky now. Look at that. We are just unstoppable. I'm not sure what I need to be worried about. Maybe unrest. Maybe unrest because unrest is going up. And uh, I'm not exactly sure what is the best way to get rid of it. Other than what I'm already doing because it's going up. And we gotta deal with the big mission. In the next day, but now we just gotta do the cutting edge because we already decided we are not gonna do the epic pistol one. <clears throat> you already got a pistol, okay? Sure. This is effectively four points because we are preventing three and getting rid of one. Alright, guys, let's go. Okay, uh, I do have some stuff. Yeah, I, I got a Mac Weave. And, wow, he didn't have the Mac Weave. He really needs the Mac Weave. Mm, that's fine. You've had, we have two Mac Weaves. Actually, maybe you shouldn't have the Mac Weave. And, uh, you're gonna have the Mac Weave. He actually has an upgrade that increases his dodge by 20. So, which would put him at 70 dodge. And 13 health, 70 dodge. And heals. Uh, when he is uh, mind connecting people. Now, that could be a pretty okay tank. Self healing tank. Who doesn't get hit that much. It would be quite Zephyr level because Zephyr can also apply a, a shield on himself, but pretty okay. Actually, Zephyr is really good at using items. Okay, I'm thinking of buying a flash bomb. Because it was by far the most important item. Uh, supply. We don't have an auto key card, but I believe the robots we're bringing uh, double up as one. Breaching charge. Yeah, I mean, we have one of these. I don't think you want more than one. A flashbang. Eh, that doesn't really matter. This is very situational. I would be more on board if we knew we're gonna need it. Yeah, I mean, we got to the point where it just doesn't really matter. I mean, to be fair, I don't have access to a lot of stuff. But I think an, a flash brain grenade is a, a, a really good one. Because based on them using it on me, we learned that disorient means uh, lower movement, lower aim, and you can't use abilities. And apparently it doesn't affect your squad mates. I'm not sure about that. But yeah, this is pretty good. Both on melee and ranged and ability, guys. So, we're gonna get another flashbang. Although, I, I also like grenades. Like, dealing damage grenades. I think that would be huge. But, let's just get a flashbang. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Okay, let's go. Send the PC. But... You're gonna have a flashbang. We can have two utility items. And I think he should have the grenade too. Because he can very easily use items. Oh, uh, what? Oh shit, I can only have one grenade. Is it? Okay. I mean, I guess that's good to know. I mean, this is not a grenade, right? The game wasn't obvious about that. Okay. So we can have one breach item, one grenade, and one other utility item. Which could be heal. I'm, I'm feeling pretty confident about the, the two flashbangs I'm bringing. Wait, what? Oh, he has a flash bomb. And he has a flashbang. Frag is good. <clears throat> I do like frag. I mean, technically, frag is more often useful 
but when flashbang is useful, it is like it saves the the bloody mission. Like someone gets mind controlled, flashbang, mind control is gone. I mean, to be fair, I can use flashbang just for general use, just to drop aim and movement. I mean, that that still makes sense, but. For cancelling abilities? Oh my god. That's why I love it. Confirmed sighting of contraband. Hostiles present. First unit through this entrance gets one armor for the encounter. Oh, okay. Well, basically we are playing on, on Iron Man. I've not lost a fight yet. I had uh, teammates go down. Like, I think like, like over like three four times, but that's it. All non-aggressive enemies guarding this entrance are surprised. Okay. So, terminal goes first. Then Zephyr. I mean, I don't think she should have the breach charge. I think Zephyr should have the breach charge. Because she's the medic. Then verge, then patchwork. Let's go. Fire in the hole. Wait, how long is this encounter? Mm, it's not super high chance to take out the bruiser. But I want to take it out. Thrall. That's the fearless advance. Uh, let's just do it on the trooper because he has armor. Four to six. Mm. No! Another four to six. Well, at least we are not getting hit on the way in. See that target? Secure it and get out. Okay, terminal. We have the special SMG. Okay, this is a one round encounter. What can Zephyr do? I'm only seeing... Oh, oh okay. We, we have five here. This is a special snake. A cobra! Wow. <laughs> we can do chain shot, but this only works if we hit the first one. And there's a lower chance to hit the first one. Hmm. If we hit the first one, then he's dead anyway. I think we might want to give Zephyr cooperation. So he goes in. Question is on who? The Acolyte can insta die from 5 to 6. The Troll can insta die as well. The Acolyte will come relatively soon. Let's just punch him. This gives us parry. And uh, we might as well take a shot at the trooper. We have an okay shot. Actually, that probably makes more sense. And stay down. We still have cover, and he's dead for sure. So this deals more damage to robotic enemies 
Basically, this is guaranteed 4 damage. <clears throat> 4 to 6. Uh, we throw a, gra a frag grenade for free, so that's fine. Who can we really punish here? Uh, we can go on the Cobra. Taking out the trial would be nice, but I don't think we can do it. Unless... He eats a frag like that. Then he's gonna be exposed. Right then we might as well. We can dash him for the capture. Or... Just send in the robot. There are not that many people in this encounter. Let's just dash him for the capture. We want to get the 20 intel. Arrested another target. Okay, Ecolite. Not dead! Okay, let's tank. But he's not loving it. <laughs> okay. There's a chance we can stun the cobra. Your thoughts are mine. Okay, the cobra is stunned. Now we can finish off the acolyte. Well, technically, we could have done a battle madness just to have the Cobra kill the Acolyte, but that's not the best. We need to deal with the Cobra. Alright, we're just gonna stay where we are. Cobra is not acting, just how we like it. Hmm. We can go in for a capture. Sets up the capture as well. Fracturing. Oh shit! No, no, no. All right, it, it's fine. It's fine. We, we got momentum, but it's actually enough. Out of my way. To get to the thing. Open the chest. Uh, do we need to run up, run out of here as well? Do people show up now? Yeah, we need to go. And it's really good that Zephyr did it because. Everyone else is a little slow. Okay, people are coming in from the the right and the back. I basically never will watch. The fiends torture her. So we can make it out in one move. So might as well subdue this guy. Stay down. The truck is gonna be full on the way back home. Uh, we can make it out. And we probably will make it out right now. Well, maybe not. I just... Let's just go there. Go here. And Overwatch. Doesn't really matter. Watching for hostiles. I won't get in your way. I guess way. I just don't want to run away. Too soon. Giving him extra speed actually wouldn't be the worst. New Having a character arise. that's fast. I think that's that you need that. You need that for these kind of missions. 
Scattered in strings. Okay. Well, he acts last, so might as well make him go now. Zephyr will get hit twice. Well, potentially twice. Let's do a... Well, I actually can do a heal on Zephyr. We have to go now. <clears throat> Go. Now we gotta go. Yeah, we're not doing anything either. Uh, we'll just go. And Zephyr most likely can take two shots from far away. <clears throat> With all the dodge and armor he has now. Alright, let's go. Clear a path. Pretty good. This would have been even more efficient if I moved toward the uh, exit before. Okay, we got some bucks. And spec, spec ops training is completed. Progeny is planning a series of heists. We can't allow them to break the city's banks. Find out what they plan to rob and shut them down before it happens. Why is that their style? Aren't they the mind control people and take their money kind? If you can do that, why would you try to rob a bank? I guess, would you just walk into the bank? And then just ask for money, I, I guess? But you're still exposing yourself to a lot of technology. When you can just literally rob 24-7 uh, people and just not deal with technology. You ever want to talk about anything? I'm around. Are you coming on to me? No. I, I mean, you rush into things in the field. I've seen that before. I know what it means. You think I have a death wish? I don't know. Do you? I rush in because I understand the concept of acceptable risk. Hmm, okay. Okay. But thanks for the vote of confidence. Okay, let's 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 upgrade here. Uh, promotion to rank principal agent has unlocked second wind. Terminal sends the gremlin to all allies, restoring four HP, cleansing burning acid, poison effects, and stabilizing allies who are bleeding out. One use permission. Oh my god, this is gonna be the the lifesaver in the in the very very difficult missions. Oh. <laughs> First ability. What you got? The gremlin scans the room, applying holo targeting to all enemies. Increases the squad's aim by 15 against mark enemies. One use permission. I don't know. Yeah, I mean... Patchwork definitely uh, has to work uh, for her uh, <laughs> position. She went on 23 missions. And Patchwork went on uh, 3. Or something like that. Two missions. To be fair, Patchwork is doing okay. Oh, new training unlocks at this rank. So I can do a new training. Can I do? Senior agent or higher. So it's not Cherub, right? Agent does not meet rank. Okay, let, let's see the rank. Agent abilities. Yeah, that's senior agent or higher. And that's field agent. Mm -hmm. What about her rank? She can... She can stay at home and uh, do this recruitment drive thing. 
special agent or higher, senior agent or higher. I mean, yeah, that's kind of nice. I guess this is one way to reuse city anarchy. The only problem with it, that it's delayed. So, for example, there is a sector that's in question and you need to deal with the anarchy. Oh, city anarchy? Oh, never mind that. I'm, 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 I'm saying nonsense here. So, this is overall anarchy, not uh, unrest. <laughs> never mind that. But yeah, it's a nice option. Okay. Now, what do we do? Do I do recruitment drive? Or do I do... Okay, let's do recruitment drive with Godmother. We take her out of the assembly. Wait, what? Begin. Yeah, I mean, the assembly st uh, still keeps working, and we put Cherub into the assembly. Although, this new girl doesn't seem to do much. And technically, you can argue for the removal of Terminal. Although, it's... I'm not, not, not sure about this, because, yeah, we can remove Terminal, because she already doesn't gain advantage, doesn't gain experience. And uh, I will probably have to do that, eventually, uh, just to get her all the bonuses uh, available uh, via training. But I, I do plan on using her. I mean, just because she's the best now, doesn't mean she'll get kicked. So we can do a situation, but yeah, we gotta stop a bank robbery. Uh, this is the guy we're planning to put in instead of patchwork. A blue blood. Stop the bank robbery. Maybe we can get the romance started. I'm very unlikely though. <laughs> it's probably all related to missions. Okay, let's go for the bank robbery. We have nothing new. But we're gonna have something new. Next turn. We're gonna have a new character. And we're gonna have a upgrade to the healer. A better weapon. A breach won't always overwhelm a hostile force. Nearby hostiles may rush in to back up their allies. Should a hostile force push back, hold steady until you've dealt with their reinforcements. Yeah, that's one other change I wanted to make. I want someone who... Well, Terminal shouldn't be the first then, because she's a healer. Damn, you really need one fast character. <laughs> we got the At least it would be a lot more difficult. I guess I now not really want the movement speed on Zephyr. Not because I I tend to struggle to go next to enemies. That's not a problem. But I mean if these for these missions, imagine just Getting the intel and getting out. First unit through this entrance gain does 3 damage during the breach. First a unit through this entrance marked until the end of the encounter. Okay, let's do Zephyr, Verge, Patchwork, and Terminal. We're all shooting, we don't use some, uh, special abilities here. Let's go like that. Time to move. Let's hit the resonant behind the door. Okay, this could kill the acolyte, but most likely won't. At least he lost his cover. And last. Hmm. I guess we're gonna take the high percentage shot. Ooh, 
What? That's a terrible cover. You shot the cover. Don't weigh in. Why are you trying to hide behind the... <laughs> uh, it's not good. Okay, this takes out quite a lot of people. Encounter one out of two. Let's make this guy go mad. Show them how you feel. As long as it is us. Then we just take him out. Subdue him. Our style we're gonna is do under another arrest. subdue. Target is under arrest. Collect the evidence, I guess we did that. There's no hostages in the lobby, just progeny bank robbers. It sounds so strange when you say it aloud. Okay. Last unit through this entrance will receive an extra action point. That doesn't seem to matter as much. Okay, let's go with... They seem to have a very similar skill set. They can both hack. Let's go. We're going in. Um. Yeah, I guess we're going to take some good shots here. Surprise, you're dead! Not dead. Let's make him dead. Anyone else we can make dead? Let's, let's make the thrall dead. No, they did die. Kill the resonant. Okay, we can move up Zephyr's turn. Take out the Acolyte. But also take out this Thrall. Arrested another target. Huh. What? No, they're too far away. That's why we need more movement. Damn. Unbelievable. I can't reach. You're gonna get shot a little bit. It's not a big concern. Go on. Lash out. Guy battle mad. Not gonna lie. That Killed always the frog. me out. Her splendor drops in place. Okay, you're dead now. Is that it? Oh, three waves remaining. Oh, oh boy, how am I gonna survive that? I guess I can go for a heal. 
Let's get your insides back inside. Where are they coming? Oh, they're gonna come in here. for hostels I guess we can't overwatch with him we're just gonna get close for the Aska King what do you mean no civilians Out what, what about these guys get out of here okay, let's do preparation What? So this goes bell mad. Okay, let, let's just go for capture. Uh, okay, let, let's take out the other guy. Subdued the hostile. Mm, there's nothing to do here. I feel like I, I may have made a very OP team here. And stay down. Right, I'm gonna need the amber enter button here. Because <laughs> there's nothing to do. On the run! I can't even use preparation. Transferring. You'll make it. I have to say, boys, this bank robbery is not going as well. One more waves remaining. Maybe, maybe get, they really gonna amp up their game for la last round. Survive the onslaught. I'm, I'm not sure. I would quite put it that way. But I guess I'm doing a good job surviving this onslaught. We need you to come. Just go for a capture. Smashing extremity. I did it. Woo. <gasps> wow. The fuck was this mission? Are you kidding me? This was that was the story mission. Well, I guess we did it. Enhanced submachine gun. And blue blood is better. Good work. Without hard currency, the city's recovery efforts would grind to a halt. New spec op operations available. Star initiative requires principal agent or higher. Agents earn 20% more XP on missions for the next five days. And the principal agent is the highest agent, right? So I can make one of my my guys. Uh, only my my highest level. More than once, progeny fleeing the scene seem to vanish without Give everyone trace. XP. Figure out how they manage this magic trick. I don't think I care about that that much. I can just keep using the same guys. I suppose the main idea that uh, you have more versatility. Clip size increased by two. I don't care. Standard shot does not ultimately end the turn. Wait, what? Oh, 
Wait, what? Does this mean I, I can shoot twice? That sounds pretty fucking good. I'm not gonna spend 100 intel on it, but how can I get re reflex grip for my for myself? Wow, actually that's 150 bucks. That's kind of yeah. It's only terminal who's affected, but I guess we're gonna get it. But other than that, I, I know that. Where do we upgrade the fucking grips? Does it come from upgrading the weapon optics? I can't help but feel that there's gotta be like some other way to get this. I mean this one not. Obviously, this is a unique uh, item, but reflex grip. I don't. I don't really want to pay 100 magnifying glasses for it. I mean, this is obviously garbage for that price. This is advanced as well. I'm, I mean, this might be something advanced. How do, how do we gain access to it? Okay. Mm, that, let's not even consider that. Wait, what? So she can go for two? Wow, really? So she can just overwatch and murder everybody. <sighs> the only problem, I think, and why we are not gonna do this, is because she's the healer and I'm not really bringing a lot of healing supplies other than her. But I do use her quite a lot. I mean, this would be another great upgrade on Zephyr. I would like this. And now we just did the main mission. The next main mission is in six days. If there is a time to for Zephyr to take a, a, a break, I think this is it. So I think he's going to unlock potential. Uh, we're doing a recruitment drive. And I have to decide what to go for. Improve medikits. That would be pretty relevant if we ever decide to get rid of the healer. Poison gear. Now what I'm thinking, should I spend... 100 intel on uh actually maybe i should because this might not be as good as i think 100 intel is is, is, is damn valuable though i don't wanna <laughs> i rather just uh get there on my own I'm not using pistols, other than the one guy who actually uses pistols. Okay. Oh, new recruits? Oh my god, we actually have more to do than- what? No, 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 no. New recruit? Really? Okay, cool. Holy crap! We got new guys! Woo! Let's see what we got. We got the the bomb man. He's the bomb. He we know about him. We got the snake! And we got the fish man. I actually want the fish man. We need some diversity hires in this district. They're just gonna accuse me of racism at this point. Moving enemies, allies, what you can do. So she is uh I mean he whatever. It's, it's a snake. Uh, willpower, base dodge, that's that's kind of good, I guess, although lowish health, but that, that kind of made up for the, the li little higher dodge, I suppose. 
wraps up an enemy, dealing damage and preventing them from acting on their turn. Bound enemies cannot be targeted by XCOM for risk of damaging the agent. Free action. What? So if you had some big ass guy? Agent shoots out their tongue to grab unit and pull them into melee range can be used on enemies and allies. Some oversized targets cannot be pulled. Okay, that's an action. <laughs> but the bind is a free action. What? So, the entire idea behind this snake man, that he pulls in a, a person, could be ally as well, and uh, and you can disable them. I guess... And... I guess they just stay disabled until you just... Actually, I, I think you take two damage. Because when the snakes catch me, uh, they deal two damage to me. So, very slowly the disabled target dies, I, I, I guess. But does the snake does anything? Can, can the snake shoot while you're disabling a target? Unclear. I don't think so. If so, not that great because you're trading one guy for one guy. And that's pretty bad. But I think we might need a, a snake diversity higher here. Other than that, we got the Axiom, uh, who is, who seems okay. Agent charges a target and smashes down with both fists. Chance to disorient, stun, or render unconscious. Higher rage improves the chance to apply disabling effect. Uh, again, we don't know the chance. Burst through the door, breach point with a chance to panic nearby enemies. Panic chance increases with rage, okay. Higher rage increases the chance of applying disabling effects and melee attacks, but also increases the risk of going berserk. Rage can be increased manually or by taking damage. I don't really need another melee guy. I think Torque seems like the most interesting one. Maybe maybe we're gonna pick up Axiom eventually. And I, I would like Claimer as well, I suppose. Just everybody, okay? Torque. Whisper. Are we good? I don't know. Did you get a lobotomy? Can't say that I did. Then no, we aren't good. Well, at least things are back to normal. Okay. Immune to poison. Oh, and can enter vent. Uh, sure. I cannot do anything with her though. Agent Sido. I know that, but there's nothing to do. Will I get some kind of upgrade that allows me to put in more people into the assembly or something like that? Modular weapons. I don't know about the upgrades. I, I, I believe that we need to do the weapon optics one. This would be relevant for the pistol ear one. Wait, what kind of weapon does the snake has? Because that's another thing that you just don't know. When you're hiring uh, guys, what kind of weapon they have. And uh, she has a submachine gun. Okay. So. Weapon optics. Maybe, maybe go for that. Grey Phoenix Poison Gear. Uh, okay. I mean, poison is not something I really value because we're just bursting everyone down. Regen Weave, Hell Weave, Overdrive Serum. That could be good too. I mean, currently I'm not even using shotguns. So, I just tried this Weapon Optics one. And where we're going... Oh, that's, that's good. Need the right. Oh, actually, that's a little better. But we shall see what we get. So we get tracer rounds. Utility item. We already got AP rounds. Armor piercing rounds as well. And on top of that we get 30 intel. Why I prefer this? Is because we are getting rid of two. 
and getting rid of three. So this is effectively a five unrest change. This gives us 50 Illyrium, one unrest and 30 Intel and credits. But the credits is not because of the mission, but we can also upgrade here. Five Intel, Alcom, pl plus 20 Intel bonus rewards for district missions. So we're going to do this upgrade. And uh, it increases the reward to 50 Intel. And we're going to come here and freeze the other one. This is a little annoying. So that will not go up, and we're gonna go to Renova Heights with the team. But we have to make items available. He's not really the best with utility items. He just likes to use abilities. So utility items are not amazing, I suppose. All right, let's go. We don't have Zephyr. Let's see how that works out. <laughs> Contraband is under heavy guard. All units through the centers get 50 dodge for one round. First unit through the centers does free damage during the bridge. Okay. So who is the most accurate one? Or at least who I want earlier. It's gonna be two encounters. In. So we deal plus 3 damage, it's 7 to 9, we can kill the Cobra. That will most likely not die from one shot. I guess we just want to take good hit chances here. Missed! Well, okay then. Oh, he's a little targeted. Very hard to hit. Let's see what we got. The trooper will act first. Resonant is the easiest to hit. The trooper is kinda hard to hit. What if I make the Cobra a uh, battle mad? Unleash your frustration. Appreciate the breathing room. Wow. Well, we have plenty of time to deal with that. Frag out. Let's we'll just expose the trooper. This battle madness is pretty damn good. So we got two shots. We have a... This lance thingy. I have a free shot. We 
Or just get close and take a lot better shots. This is an action, for sure. Okay, we gotta get closer. Eyes open. Actions available one. So we can take a free action on the hitman. How tough he is. Four to six. So this actually kills him. Even though it looks a little weird now because... Okay, fine. We can kill him. 60%. Gotcha. Patchwork is kind of bad. sure what to do. Well, we can deal with the Cobra. That's for sure. If I do Chaining Jolt, then this ends the turn, doesn't it? Let's see if it does. Zapping the target. Left a mark. Does it? Covering it ends the turn. That's that makes it significantly worse than many of their abilities. Okay, I can get rid of the poison. No, I'm not gonna safeguard that guy. Need a little help? So many gremlins. Um alive oh nice wow well done civilian stop the hostage taker okay let's go one of them mad let's go make one of them mad resonant you killed the cobra wow unconscious what the fuck and he's gonna go unconscious as well. Wow. I definitely like Verge. He's he's OP basically. He can disable, plus he can use the madness to deal damage. All units entering here get free mobility for one round. Uh, okay. Oh, Non-aggressive enemies guarding this entrance are surprised. First unit through this entrance does free damage during the breach. Fine. Uh, let's go verge. Patchwork and terminal. Blow it. So we do plus three damage. Sixty-seven. Hit the necromancer. Well, it can wait. Six to seven. Again, not a guaranteed hit kill. Unless I do a lancer shot, in which case. It's a little better. We can hit the necromancer and the trooper. The Necromancer takes two hits. They basically both take two hits. Oh, Sorcerer? Oh, he has two armor. God damn. But I guess we gotta take the 100% chance to hit. Wow. 
Well, okay then. Sorcerer does seem a little stronger, I suppose. See that target? Secure it and get out. What? Oh, I see. Uh, let's move terminal up. Now let's do a double hit. Oh, um, okay. The thing is, this doesn't kill him for sure. We have to take an 80%. If I hit like this, then it's basically a 50% chance of killing him because it's a 3 to 4. But if I hit like this, it's 80% chance of killing him. Because Boom. all damage kills him. Alright, yeah. In this scenario, 62% and only 1 out of 3 of that killing him, so not great. So it's 20% chance. Bad. Might as well just hit the sorcerer a little bit. Although the trial is... Does this have like a 100% chance to hit? Wait, how is she not getting hit? I think this is a 1% chance to hit. And she can get hit by it? Let's, let's do it. What is the friendly fire? I guess I'm not supposed to hit that. Fine. She's a little tanky here. This troll most likely will take two hits as well. Let's soften him up. The sorcerer sounds like someone who has abilities. Find some corneas. So, you take a flashbang. Whatever you got, don't use it. Oh, it's deflected. Oh my god. Chance of hitting twice. Or can I hit someone else? The chance to hit is pretty bad. I guess I can move. Try to kill the acolyte over here. Gotta get moving. Come on, hustle. What? Four to six. Um let's take the chain shot. Disabling the sorcerer probably is the best choice if he can do it. We can't. Really low chance. Or I don't know. What's up with that? Let's have the bruiser go mental. Enemies all around you. Hit the sorcerer. Unsettling. Every time. I guess not. Well, we can take a decent shot at her. So this is just guaranteed 4 damage. Uh, uh, and that ignores armor. chance for damage. I see the appeal, I suppose. But other characters can do more than just guaranteed some damage. Immune to the mental effects. Wow, 
Wow. What? Be silent. Uh, yeah, let's kill this guy. Let's take a normal shot. Should we just cap him? I don't want to get the robot right now. Hostile is down and out. So where are we leaving? This is where we came in. Oh, it's the reinforcements are coming this way. They're automatically coming. I suppose we're gonna go for the on the way the capture anyway because they're coming automatically I suppose my choice early game was about what kind of items I want uh, for myself but I didn't quite realize that because now we have access to some some gear that the gay phoenix used hmm. okay let's go closer but don't use the whole dash just try to make sure that if someone shows up we are counting soften them up <laughs> You're staying there, okay? Heading over. I'm nearly dry. Do anyone in this world ever use the door with the handle, or does everyone only kick it in? Okay, we can all go. So let's all go. I was nearly out. Let's get your insides back inside. Good. That's good. I'm moving. I guess I could have given her an extra action as well. That may have made more sense. What? Why are you always so bad? Oh my god. Verge. We need you guys. We need you some running shoes. I thought you could make it. We need some <laughs> upgrades for Verge. We need some items. I don't know. It's gotta be the running shoes. Okay. Watch my back. I should have given an extra action to Verge. I should know the deal by now. At least not Verge was getting hit, so he can most likely survive to tanker. Dudes hitting him for a round. Oh fuck. Wait. Oh my god. Verge, time to go. Time, time to go. You definitely don't want to stay here for one more round, okay? Yeah, I'll just go. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. This guy really wants to die. We only managed to ca capture five guys, so. But Verge is still very useful. I, I, I'm still still feeling pretty confident about my choice because get, gaining a little bit more accuracy with Verge would matter very little. 
but gaining 20 intel all the time, that matters quite a lot. So we've got tracer rounds and AP rounds, and of course, we managed to unrest as much as we can. Are from the old Shrike network. City 31 paid them to provide security just after the war. After the formation of 3-1 PD, Shrike was cut loose. By then, they were more of a mercenary outfit than resistance group. Who's in charge? It's not that simple. Shrike operates in a loose cell structure. Each cell determines which jobs they're willing to take. Some help guard the city's food supply. And others are muscle for seriously shady people. So what if we run into more in the field? They should have the sense to avoid a fight with reclamation. And if they don't? Standard rules of engagement. <laughs> That's one way to say kill them all! Verge, I need a comm check. Yes. Go ahead. Check, check. One, two, check. Can you hear me? I sensed it. Right. But Verge, you know how a comm check works. Yes. Then, wait. Are you messing with me? Ha. Ah. Yes. Well, at least you're honest about it. Alright, let's see what we got. Has unlocked Puppeteer. Verge mind controls all enemies in the neural network. The effect only lasts for the remainder of the turn. Once what use permission? What the fuck, Verge? That's insane. <sighs> Only the remainder of the turn though. Not like their mind control, like oh permanent mind control on you. Also, that that's the that's the most bullshit part about it. That they put mind control on you, then they just fucking run away. Full sprint. Every single time. That's how it always works. Fucking hate that. <laughs> I think this Verge is like ridiculously OP. Verge, you're, you're damn good. I kind of want to upgrade you. But you're also a little... If only you had like two more mobility. But I guess you can be best at everything. What else we got? She upgrades. Upgrades combat... Scanners to have one additional use permission grants 25 crit to all allies at the breach point. I mean, this is we 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 sacrifice Patchwork's uh, action to have these combat scanners that I just never use because I just take the shot. The gremlin shocks enemies if they move too close to Patchwork or if Patchwork moves too close to them. This attack chains to nearby enemies. So, basically we got a free action, if we move close to people. So this is where we get our free action. We have a uh, plus 4, possibly a plus 7, I, I suppose, if we move close to robots. But, am I right? Yeah, I mean, that's the whole point, that we are good against robots. But Vol Voltaic Arc is definitely the way to go. Unless you want some dedicated support, but why? It's a four-man team. So, we gotta go for that. Don't I have some idle agents? I definitely have some idle agents. We have new supply items. That you can only find when you go into the armory. So... So you cannot find it in the supply thing. <laughs> so it's gotta be armory. And uh let's say No no no. Damn. Okay. Wait. I don't have to go into the armory just to click on their pictures. Why? Okay. That that's better actually. So we have advanced expanded magazine. Same thing, but I got ammo, and the ammo needs to be equipped here. So, let's say we try it on her. We have these rounds grant 5 aim to an agent when equipped. That's not as great. Because we have uh, the holo targeting rounds. I'm not sure who has it right now. Don't I have it? 
Oh, we got targeting system. Right, 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 right. Uh, that's that's different. But let's see. So tracer rounds, five aim to an agent when equipped. It's very minor. AP rounds, armor piercing grants ignore five armor. Oftentimes, most enemies have like one armor. I don't I don't know if this is because of the difficulty. Like they have one or, or zero armor. And only very specific enemies have two or more. So I think the AP rounds makes a lot of sense for anyone who shoots often. Like uh, this blue blood guy. But yeah, I mean, we can go for some upgrades on the primary weapon. If there... That, that's the most empty slot I got. <laughs> that's super empty. Hmm... And we also have the tracer runs, which is just like, okay, you got tracer runs, that's fine. I can put it on someone who's... I mean, Verge doesn't shoot that often. He's he's the ability shoot kind of person, or sh ability ability. And uh, the same thing with Terminal, she does ability plus shoot. Same thing with Patchwork. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna be... Available anytime soon. I could use more slots in here. Ah, <sighs> because Mr. Snake doesn't really have anything to do. I guess I can take him on a mission. What I can do, if the, if it's an easy mission, I just take out one of my guys who already have uh, a lot of experience. Bad operations. This makes more sense, because Illyrium is hard to get. Oh, actually, I can just keep... Yeah, I can just... Uh, only the weapon Oplex will be ready. So we can get 45 Illyrium. And keep in mind, uh, credits are easier to get back at base. It's You can get 75 credits or uh, 20 Illyrium at the same time. So... 45 Illyrium is what I'm going to uh, accept here. How does it work, though? So, this is not a mission. This is a situation, right? On district missions. So, that will not work. Uh, by boosting it, I'm just taking whatever reward I want. And that's it. So, let's just take the 45 Illyrium. I know it doesn't seem to be useful right now. And I suppose Illyrium will stop being useful. But this allows me to focus on intel and and uh, credits more. So we're gonna get this. And Weapon Optics is ready. How old is this building? New supply items? Years, so we got everything. scope. Just needs a little elbow grease. And a whole lot of Isn't elbows. this the same thing I got? Yes, grease, because... This place doesn't have enough of that. No, that's the tracer rounds. The problem with those upgrades, even though they are uh, clear upgrades, I suppose, is that they are pretty expensive. So I can get the pistol upgrade, but that's only for one person. I can also get the Mastercrafted Assault Rifles, which would take me six turns, but that actually applies to, uh, well, two people right now in the team, but I suppose that changes. The main advantage of uh, going with Assault Rifles is that Verge is gonna get it. I think it's the problem with Verge and Terminal is that they already have the max rank. So, maybe we don't want to do that right now. Anyway, uh, that's it for that, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.